Hi there, students. A whistleblower. Okay, a whistleblower is a person who reports on wrongdoing or corruption in a company or an organization, particularly public corruption. So, if the government is doing something that is bad, that's really bad for the public, then a whistleblower is a person who reports this, who makes this public knowledge. Yeah? Um, so, for example, Karen Silkwood was a whistleblower. She informed about um, a nuclear power plant in the US that was effectively poisoning the people. I don't know if you saw a film called, I think it was Erin Brockowitz, yeah? Well, this is about a whistleblower. Now, in most countries, there are laws to protect a whistleblower so that they um, the employer or the government or whoever cannot take, um, cannot get retribution against them. They can't sack them or demote them or something like that. Yeah? So a whistleblower is somebody who reports that a company, an organization, the government is doing something illegal. I was going to say immoral, but maybe immoral things are very often legal, so it probably doesn't count. If, um, if, so, um, if a company is uh, not paying its taxes and somebody reports the company to the tax authority, then they are a whistleblower. Maybe if in the stock exchange in the financial markets somebody is uh, doing something illegal to manipulate the market and uh, somebody in that company reports them to the financial authorities then this person is a whistleblower um, there have been examples of this about medicine uh, and in hospitals and things like that. So that if uh, pharmaceutical companies or hospitals are doing something that is ha harming the patient significantly, then a whistleblower is somebody who makes this public knowledge. Yeah. So it's to report wrongdoing of your organization to do this to be a whistleblower you need to work inside the organization and that's why you know what's happening i think maybe edward snowden was a whistleblower about the things that the american security agency was doing yeah the, the nsa okay but with, men, with some of these things, there's a question of where, when is the person a whistleblower? Or the government would say they are acting as a spy or this is espionage. So clearly an employee, a worker, has some, uh, should have some uh, fidelity to their employer. However, if their employer is doing something illegal, then they should blow the whistle. With this word whistleblower, I have the idea of a referee with a whistle. Yeah, and when the referee sees illegal behavior, he goes, yeah, foul. Okay, but this is much more metaphoric. So notice, a whistleblower blows the whistle. Not a whistle, the whistle. To blow the whistle on your company. To blow the whistle on your boss. Yeah? Maybe you could, bl you could go and report your boss for doing something that is illegal to the higher echelons of your company. This would be uh, blowing the whistle. 
to be a whistleblower. Okay, what about formality? Well, I would say this is neutral. I think you could use it in an informal conversation, but you could probably also use it in a very formal academic document or something like that. Although I would only give it a five in formality. It's a very technical word that says exactly what it means. I think originally this was probably an Americanism. Okay, So, a whistleblower, a person who reports officially wrongdoing or corruption or something like that of the company or organisation that they work, to, work for. So, there you go. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. A whistleblower blows the whistle.